Our lives are mainly the same. We go to work or school, go home, and go to other specific places. In each of these places, we need our phones to be set to a specific volume, or may never use the GPS or Bluetooth, so we may want to switch them off. While we usually have to go and manually adjust our settings for every place that we travel to, wouldn't it be nice if our phone could do it for us? With profiles on your OnePlus One, that is exactly what your phone will do, based on which Wi-Fi network you connect or disconnect from. All of these settings happen in the background and are instantaneous, so you don't even need to worry about any of it. If you want, NFC cards can be assigned to profiles too. Stay tuned to see how to set up profiles using both of these methods. To get to profiles, head to settings from the notification center and then head down to profiles under the personal heading. Make sure that the toggle is set to on and hit the plus button to the bottom right to get started. Now input a name from the place that the profile will be used in, for example I'll put in work. Now it's time to set what happens in that profile. Depending on what the job is, you'll probably not need Bluetooth or your GPS to be on. And I'll just keep going down until I have a good work profile. Now at volume overrides, you can set what your volume will be. For a workplace, you'll probably want sound produced from your phone to be really low. Although I still want to be alerted for any incoming calls. So I'll want the volume to be able to be heard. To do this, I will leave all the volumes at zero except for the ringtone. And heading down to system settings, I want to be able to hear the, my phone if it rings, so I'll set the ringer volume to normal. I don't want any of these other options to change, so I'll just leave the checkboxes unchecked. Just as a quick note, any checkboxes left unchecked will retain the settings from your previous profile, and also bear in mind that you can manually change your settings even after changing the profile. So I can still lower my ringer volume if I have to go off to a meeting. Right at the bottom are application profiles that can set certain modes for different apps, for example, at work I may not want my games to send me notifications, but I may want email notifications. To change these application profiles, simply press the back button and then slide to the right to application profiles. Here you can add or remove application profiles. Now to actually change these profiles automatically, you must assign the profile to an NFC tag or the change in your Wi-Fi network. Firstly, for NFC, simply press the button to the bottom left and tap the phone against an NFC tag. This will write the profile onto the tag. To trigger the profile, simply touch the phone to the tag. Retouching the tag switches your phone to your previous profile. So bear that in mind if you want to attach the tag to a phone stand or something like that. For the Wi-Fi option, simply tap on the central button at the bottom. Here you can see all of your Wi-Fi networks. Tapping on one will allow you to trigger the profile on connect or on disconnect. On disconnect is useful for profiles such as my going out profile where I switch on my GPS, switch off Bluetooth and adjust some of my volumes. This will be triggered any time you leave a Wi-Fi network. On connect will be triggered any time you join a Wi-Fi network. That's it, to save the profile simply press back and it all should be set.